Hi, I'm Grizzly Adams. Yeah, I've wrestled bears. I've chopped down a tire for them. Built log cabins with my bare hands. You got to know yourself to be able to do these things. It's about commitment. It's about inner strength. It's about courage. Let me tell you a story about five guys that embody this rugged exterior. Massachusetts, the birthplace of a nation and the fierce spirit of independence. You can still see it today, more than two centuries later, in the unified facial front of the Patriots' offensive line. Left tackle, Matt Light, Matthew McConaughey. We don't get scared. Not, you, that's part of the beard. Left guard, Logan Mankin, the Merlin Olsen. It's got a lot of girth on it right now, so it's a pretty good beard. Center, Dan Copen, the resident red beard. Copen looks like he got kidnapped by the Amish family that lives in Foxborough. That may have been a true story. I, you know, I may have been kidnapped. If that's his opinion, then that's his opinion. Right guard, Stephen Neal, the Ambrose Burnside. I heard the story about uh, Ambrose Burnside about three or four times from different, uh, different people. Right tackle, Nick Kayser, the Abraham Lincoln. I don't really like having an uh, upper lip hair, really, so I just uh, went with this. But it's wintertime, and when it's 10 degrees out there, you need a little something to cover your face. Well, I think a lot of people in New England sport beers. And a lot of it's due to your, your weather conditions. I think if Santa Claus was from Florida, you wouldn't see a beard on Santa. You know, there was a time when Tom Brady was one of those guys. The time when he wore the robust badge of courage along with his brothers in the trenches. But oh, how times have changed. He's actually sported a, some upper lip plumage over the years. Um, doesn't stick around as long, but you know, he just doesn't have the intestinal fortitude to really stay with it. He needs to sort of, you know, cover up the butt on his chin that he has, but you know, Tom's one of those guys, he's the best dressed person in America or the world. You know, I don't think us five can sway his personality. The beard is a symbol of rugged individualism, but the Patriots, they made it more, much more. The beard has become an unbreakable bond of solidarity.